You need to hear this if you're into political drama. Trump's $454 million fraud penalty is taking center stage once again. On Thursday, a New York State appeals court grilled prosecutors on former President Trump's massive $454 million civil fraud judgment. Judge Arthur Engeron found Trump and his associates guilty of misleading lenders and insurance companies to secure better deals. But Trump's not backing down, calling it election interference and draconian. His lawyers argue some allegations were outside the statute of limitations and that no one actually lost money. Judges seemed intrigued by these points, questioning if the penalties fit the supposed crime. Justice Friedman noted, no one lost any money. And Justice Moulton said, the immense penalty is troubling. Trump maintains his innocence, stating, the banks made money. Prosecutors countered that fraud doesn't need financial harm to be illegal. The New York Appellate Court will decide in about a month just in time for Election Day. Will Trump's penalty stand or will it be overturned? Stay tuned.